Hello and welcome back to another hit film tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to clone yourself or others or whoever. Uh, and all it requires, it's a really simple effect, all it requires is you standing in one location, then moving and standing in the other location. So as you can see in my media bin, I have footage left and footage right. The left footage is me standing on the left and the right footage is me standing on the right. To create this effect, I'm going to left click on footage left, then right click and press make composite shot, and then I'm going to leave everything the same, then I'm going to hit OK. So as you can see, there's just me stood there, and I'm waving my arms around. So I'm just now going to cut it down to the bit that I need. So I end with watch, then I turn. Now I'm going to drag that to there. Move forward, move back by a couple of frames, so that then copy the timecode and paste it in the settings for the duration. So now all this is, is my shot, so there's no extra stuff. Now I'm going to drag footage right into the shot. And I know that the section of the video that I want is when I draw the gun. Find the bit of footage that you want for your thing. So watch, I pull up the gun. Now all I have to do is click on the top footage layer, grab the masking tool, it doesn't really matter which one as long as you can cut out your person, and then I'm just going to chop down the middle, and now there's me stood on both sides of the shot. Now I'm going to go into the controls, and in shape, and I'm going to set the feather strength to something like 100. This just smooths out the central area. So as you can see, I talk to the camera, and then I also pull out the gun. However, they're on two separate sides of the shot, so uh, this is some basic cloning. You can do all sorts of things with cloning. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, then please leave a like and subscribe. This was a very quick tutorial just showing some basic cloning. Goodbye.